Hey guys, um, I am sorry I'm being quiet. Jake is asleep. Um, I did a really quick, just wanted to do a very quick Monday reads. Um, I finished two books. I'm really, really excited. Um, so I did finish How I Became a Nun by Cesar Aida, translated by Chris Andrews. And this is even <laughs> weirder than it started off as that didn't make sense the way that I spoke, but, um, it's just really frustrating because I can't really talk about what was so weird about it because then I will be a huge spoiler for the book, but I will talk a little bit more about it. Um, when I do my monthly wrap up eventually, and I will say I'm going to do my July wrap up soon. The J I, I have already filmed my August wrap up and my September, October wrap up. And then my November books are right here. Um, but the problem is that July was so long ago, so like I keep, I need to like, like really think very hard to do that one. Um, thankfully, some of the books were book two prize books, so hopefully I have like some footage of me talking about them, but who knows. Um, and then the other book that I finished was Where the Wild Ladies Are by Ayoko Matsuda, translated by Polly Barton. And this is a soft skull um, press book. And then I think this is yeah, a new, new directions paperback. Um, so I'm really excited about that. Um, I don't have a lot of plans for the rest of the year. Um, I feel, yeah, still overwhelmed, but not as bad as I was because I like mailed most of the Christmas presents that I had out. I'm still needing to send out some Christmas cards that I guess, I mean, they're all holiday cards that, you know, it's mostly focused on Happy New Year at this point. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I need to do that. Um, and I'm, I'm so tempted to start something new. Like I want, I cannot express to you how badly I want to start a new book. First of all, I have uh, so many plans for next year. <laughs> I need to do my like goals video and like bullet journal video, but we keep getting new patients at work and I just like don't have time. Um, so yeah, I have a lot of plans. And there's like book clubs that I want to participate in. And I just got some of the books and it's like, ah, the urge to start them right now is so strong, but I am determined to be a good girl and only read books that I have previously started. Um, the next one that I'm going to try to finish is uh, Frantumalia, the Elena Fronte like interview book. Um, I'm also still working on 2666, obviously. And again, I've got like my whole cart of books. Um, I'll be pleased if I finish even one thing from it. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm like really proud of myself. I feel like I'm getting my groove back. I mean, finishing two books, <laughs> like who do I think I am? <laughs> I didn't have very much left to read in either of them, but it doesn't matter. I feel successful. And if you feel successful, you are successful. And now I'm just talking nonsense because that's what happens. Um, I appreciate you guys very much. I'm also really behind on responding to comments. Like really, 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 really behind. It's part of the reason why I haven't done my July wrap up yet because I haven't finished responding to my June comments yet. So maybe I'll do that tomorrow. Also, I'm really into these homesteading YouTube videos all of a sudden. Like freezer prep and like all of this stuff I'm that's like all I'm spending my time watching on YouTube now instead of book related content but I feel like we all kind of go through phases and I don't know why it's really satisfying to watch someone cook for hours <laughs> anyways I really I need to go to bed um uh, but I'll talk to you guys hopefully wish me luck that they're my goal for this week is my bullet journal slash goals video and my July wrap up. Please let it happen. We'll find out together. I guess Christmas is like in a minute, but whatever. There's other days around Christmas. I'm just going to go. Bye guys.